it's a real test case for Tunisia. So uh, Reporters Sans Frontières and other human rights groups, along with the secular press in Tunisia, and there's, there's a lot of newspapers in Tunisia since the revolution, uh, they will be uh, very happy at this ruling. As I say, there was a say he could get a much harsher sentence. This is a real test case. And from now on, uh, various uh, indictments, if you like, against newspapers which are, are deemed to have breached uh, standards of decency. Uh, from now on, uh, this will be seen as a test case and they may have a much, uh, a much lighter hand. Uh, but, but as I say, a real sense of relief amongst uh, secular Tunisians uh, who, who seek a, a free press.